Hi everyone. Let's see how to create a sales order in Zoho Books. A sales order is a document that confirms a sale. In order to create sales orders in Zoho Books, you need to enable the sales order module first. Go to settings and click preferences. Then mark the box against sales orders and click save. Now go back to the dashboard and click sales. You'll find the sales order module listed here. Click that. Then click add new. Choose the customer. Then enter the sales order number. By default, the sales order number will be auto generated. You can disable it if you wish. Click the gear icon here. You can also change the sales order number format. Then you can enter a reference number if you wish. Here, we're entering the customer's purchase order number. Enter the date of raising the sales order. You can also enter the expected shipment date. This will help you prioritize your orders for processing. Then comes the delivery method. You can either select a method from the dropdown or type to add. Next, you can add a salesperson. You can click the manage salesperson icon to add a new salesperson. Then add the item details. You can add a discount if you wish. You can also choose whether you want to give a discount based on a certain percentage or enter a specific amount. You can add the shipping charges and adjustment here. If you wish to attach a file, you can click here. You can also add the customer notes and terms and conditions. If you have added this in the sales order preferences, then it will get auto populated here. You can save it as draft or save and send to your customers or save and print it. If you've enabled approval workflow in your organization, then you can submit for approval. We'll choose save and send in this video. Here, you can edit the sales orders, download the PDF, print it, email the sales orders to the customers and attach a document. Once you have delivered the items to your customer, you can easily convert the sales order into an invoice. However, there might be times when you run out of stock. In such a case, you will have to place an order with your vendor for the items in your sales order and then deliver it to your customers. You can click convert to purchase order and convert this sales order to purchase order in just a few clicks. If you wish to cancel the items that you have partially invoiced to your customers, you can click cancel items. You can also void, clone, or delete this sales order. In Zoho Books, you can create a sales order in the draft status, mark it as open once it's confirmed, and then close it once you've delivered the goods and invoiced your customers. However, this is specific to each business. You might have additional stages while processing your sales order. With this feature, you can create a custom status for these stages and associate it to the sales order. Let's see how to do that. Go to settings and click preferences. Click sales orders. Then click custom status. Click add new custom status. Choose the parent status for which you want to create a custom status. Enter the status name. Choose the label color here. You can also give a description, then click save. Now you can use this status for sales orders that you create. That's all about creating sales orders in Zoho Books. If you have any queries, feel free to write to us at support at the rate Thank you.